Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am Borderwise, and welcome back to From the Depths. And just a little quick uh, tutorial slash guide uh, to share a thing that I've been doing quite often recently in my builds because it is just so wonderful. And shockingly and regrettably, I don't remember what craft I copied this from. I do recall it was a Skull Dawn vessel of some kind. Let's see if I can just glance and little... I think it's the velocity, uh, but I'm not sure. But uh, anyway, it's how to control uh, your pitch and your yaw just by using your main propulsion using ACBs. So, as what usually tends to be the case, if you can do it with ACBs, you can almost certainly do it uh, with breadboard and lure. But I like to keep things simple, and ACBs are nice and simple, so we're going to stick with that. So, here we have a wee plane that I made uh, for demonstration purposes. And you'll notice that, uh, well, firstly, the fact that cones uh, in materials is absolutely lovely, because it means you can make a nice pointy nose. Uh, but also, there's a propeller back here, and this propeller is going kind of nuts. So, you'll see here, it is twitching around in all directions, and it is in fact controlling uh, the pitch, the yaw, and the altitude of this thing, because this is a plane, and it's set to uh, change its altitude using pitch controls. Which is very convenient, because it means that all it needs is the propeller on the back, and the aerolons on the side, and away you go. You don't need anything else. The main propulsion is not only pushing it forward, but controlling where it goes, which is absolutely fan-dabby-dozy. Uh, so how do we do this? Well, in the very basic insides of this thing, we have four ACBs here in the front. So, if I just turn this fellow off. So, if pitch command is up, it will set pitches of propulsion components to 15. Very simple. And if the pitch command is down, it'll set pitches to negative 15. Again, very simple. At least it is in theory, I keep stuffing this up because, uh, bear this in mind, uh, what the direction your propulsion actually points in, if you change its pitch and or its yaw, uh, kind of depends on how it's orientated. So, if I select this propeller here, for instance, Bear in mind that you can rotate this thing around, and that does affect uh, what exactly, you know, pitch up or pitch down is. So it does help to fiddle around a little bit uh, with your craft to make sure that you've set that up right. And your, it's very similar. If your command is left, it'll set propulsion pitch to 15 degrees. And if your command is right, it'll set yours to minus 15 degrees. And part of the reason I'm making this tutorial and saying this out loud is so I remember myself now that I've prefabbed these things, and hopefully I won't forget either. So, one further note is that if you, say, have other propulsion on this thing, you can use the block naming mechanic uh, to just, you know, make sure that it doesn't, uh, you, like, it doesn't control any propulsion component that it's not supposed to. So I'm going to set here uh, this to main, main prop. I'm going to copy that, and I'm going to go here, and I'm going to put that there, and I'm going to put that there, and I'm going to put this here, and so now, if I do this, you'll see that this thing is just pitching up wildly, because uh, that, po uh, that, uh, that propeller is not being controlled by the ACBs anymore, but that's okay, because we can do this. So now that propelled that propeller is being controlled and it's only that one and it's all fan dabby dozy mate and very lovely indeed. So that's one more thing to note. And one more further thing to note in this very very short video is that you can set ACBs to control uh, to mess around with um, uh, roll control as well. So if you set say uh, two more propellers on the side here you could potentially replace these aerolons uh, with propulsions, but you do need to give them separate names and ensure that different ACBs are controlling them uh, so the thing doesn't roll all willy-nilly. So that's uh, that's very handy to know. And that's about it. This is a very simple, uh, well, a simple by from the depth standards, uh, keep in mind. Um, it's a pretty simple way of just with minimum blocks and uh, making sure that your craft can control itself quite nicely. In fact, uh, it means that you can potentially set your main propulsion in 
quite interesting locations. You could put it above the center of drag, you could put it above or below the center of mass, and like with these this ACB setup, you could still have the thing control its positioning quite nicely. And I just really want to make a fighter plane or something that looks something like this, because I think this looks really cool. So yeah, that about does it for this little mini tutorial. I hope you found it helpful, or if you didn't, at least I hope you like uh, the nose of my plane, because man, I love cones. Cones are great. And thank you all so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. Support me on Patreon or YouTube membership if you like. It really helps, and there's fun perks in it for you. Thank you to all my current supporters, and I will see you next time in From the Depths. Farewell.